if simulation theory is true, then、um, it is actually very likely that、uh, the most interesting outcome is the is the most likely, because only the simulations that are interesting will continue. This makes a lot of sense. Have you noticed the most beautiful people? They are often etched with great suffering. And through that suffering, forged in fire, they cultivate something remarkable with themselves. The most beautiful people suffer; they are in pain. But in overcoming that suffering, in having peaks and troughs, an interesting song to their life, they cultivate something that echoes in eternity. The simulators will stop any simulations that are boring because they're 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 not interesting. In in this reality that we live in, we we run simulations all the time. Like so, when we try to figure out if the rocket's、uh, gonna make it, we run、um, thousands, sometimes millions, of simulations. It is as the Bible had said: it is the glory of God to conceal a matter, but the honor of kings is to search out a matter. God creates adventure; He creates things for you to find, explore, discover, and things to do. He creates an interesting story, and that naturally entails suffering. It applies to our own lives. We living in a simulation run simulations that help us uncover truth. That is what is interesting: truth and beauty. Just to figure out which which、uh, path is the good path for the rocket, and and where can it go wrong, where can it fail.、Um, but we when we do these. I said at this point, millions of simulations of, of what can happen with the rocket.、Um, we keep the simulations going that are the most interesting to us. Now you understand why you have a free will capable of evil, and when you understand, it makes sense as to why Satan exists. Satan had everything; he had a boring life in essence. Because when you have all the money, all the status, all the good looks and beauty, everything, everything, all the wisdom, all the knowledge, what left do you have to do? You rebel, you burn down what was given to you because it's not interesting anymore. That's why evil is born. It's reality. Getting bored of peace, getting bored of all the good God gives, and rebelling. Um. So if simulation theory is accurate, if if it is true, who knows? Um. Then the.、Uh, The the, the 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 simulators will will only they will continue to run the simulations that are most interesting. The only surviving simulations will be the interest the most interesting ones. And in order to、um, avoid getting turned off,、uh, the only rule is you must keep it interesting, or you will if or you will, because the boring simulations will be terminated. This is why you suffer, and this is also why you realize some of the most broken, miserable people. They literally have everything. Some of the most blissful, happy people. They have little, and they're constantly suffering. But through that suffering, they gain meaning. They gain purpose. They gain an interesting life. The peaks and troughs tell an interesting story, and through it, their life has meaning. It all has meaning to God, to the universe, and even to the being suffering. They have their own bliss. That is the story. That is the aim. It is to find peace. Joy, meaning in the suffering, and to our highest emotion, love, God, to reflect Him as we do.